Queen's Gambit accepted, central variation, Alec Hines system, 4.e5 and d5.5.bxc4 and b66.bd3 and c6. Giveaway one player was winning, but then gave it away. That game was pretty competitive. Both players had an amazing opening. That was a well-fought middle game that Black got the better of. Opening with the Queen's pawn controls the center and usually leads to a more positional development of the pieces. d5 establishes a presence in the center, controls the e4 square, and opens up the light squared bishop. The Queen's gambit offers up a wing pawn to attack the center and distract Black from the e4 square. The Queen's gambit accepted immediately captures the c4 pawn and forces White to prove an advantage with one less pawn. E4 takes full control of the center and allows the light squared bishop to attack the pawn on c4. Nf6 develops the knight toward the center and attacks the e4 pawn. E5 takes space in the center and attacks the knight on f6. Nd5 moves the attacked knight toward the center where it attacks many important squares. Bxc4 captures the c4 pawn, develops the bishop and attacks the knight on d5. Nb6 retreats the attacked knight to a square where it attacks the bishop on c4. Bd3 develops the bishop toward the center, controls the e4 square and sets a trap where if black captures the d4 pawn, then white wins the black queen with bb5+. Nc6 develops the knight toward the center and attacks the d4 and e5 pawns. This develops a knight off its starting square, getting it into the action. This activates a bishop by developing it off of its starting square. This threatens to win a pawn. The opposing bishop is kicked by a pawn, and must now move or be captured. This move puts the bishop on a safer square. This activates a knight by developing it off of its starting square. It is the last book move. This develops a queen off its starting square, getting it into the action. It is best. That's what I would have recommended. It is best. That's fine. It is good. This wins time by threatening a queen and forcing it to move away. It is best. This defends the attacked pawn. It is best. This ignores an opportunity to develop a bishop off its starting square. It is an inaccuracy. This prepares the bishop for development. This is the only good move. It is a great move. This defends a pawn that was under attack and had no defenders. It is best. A solid choice. It is excellent. One of the best moves. It is excellent. This moves the bishop to a better location, allowing it to control more squares. It is excellent. That's not a mistake, but it's not the best move either. It is good. This attacks a bishop, winning a tempo when it moves away. It is best. This move puts the bishop on a safer square. It is good. This is the strongest option. It is best. Very precise. It is best. This activates a bishop by developing it off of its starting square. It is best. This steps away from the checking bishop. It is best. This ignores a better way to defend a pawn that was under attack. It is an inaccuracy. Right on target. It is best. This is a fair move. It is good. This activates a queen by developing it off of its starting square. It is best. The opposing knight is kicked by a pawn, and must now move or be captured. It is good. After all captures, this is an equal trade. This is the only move that works. It is a great move. This reveals an attack on a knight. It is best. This is an equal trade. It is best. This overlooks a better way to recapture a piece. It is an inaccuracy. This maintains the balance in material with a good trade. It is best. Takes back. It is best. This moves the bishop to a more active square, making it gain scope. It is best. This develops a rook off its starting square getting it into the action. It is best. This protects an underdefended pawn that is under attack. This is the only good move. It is a great move. This defends the attacked pawn. 
it is excellent. This threatens to create an X-ray attack through two pieces. It is best. This overlooks an opportunity to centralize a knight so it controls more squares. It is an inaccuracy. There was only one good move in that position. It is a mistake. The game was close to balanced, but now black is worse. It is a miss. This ignores an opportunity to threaten winning a pawn. It is a miss. It is a miss. This threatens to win a pawn. It is best. This move puts the pawn on a safer square. It is excellent. That's fine. It is good. This wins time by threatening a bishop and forcing it to move away. It is good. This ignores an opportunity to add a defender to a vulnerable bishop. It is an inaccuracy. This move puts the rook on a safer square. It is good. After all captures, this is an equal trade. It is excellent. Recaptures. It is best. That's not a mistake, but it's not the best move either. It is good. This is not the right idea. It is an inaccuracy. The opposing rook is kicked by a pawn, and must now move or be captured. It is good. This move puts the rook on a safer square. It is good. That's what I would have recommended. It is best. The game was close to equal, but now white has the advantage. It is an inaccuracy. White had an advantage, but now the game is close to equal. It is an inaccuracy. This is a fair move. It is good. That's fine. It is good. This is the strongest option. It is best. A very strong play. It is excellent. That's a sensible reply. It is excellent. This overlooks an opportunity to connect rooks. It is an inaccuracy. This ignores a better way to add a defender to a vulnerable pawn. It is an inaccuracy. Very precise. It is best. Right on target. It is best. Takes back. It is best. This wins time by threatening a rook and forcing it to move away. It is best. This loses material. It is a mistake. This wins material. This is the only good move. It is a great move. That was a truly amazing move. It is brilliant. Giveaway one player was winning, but then gave it away. That game was pretty competitive. Both players had an amazing opening. That was a well-fought middle game that Black got the better of. Capturing that rook wins material. It is best. Giveaway one player was winning, but then gave it away. That game was pretty competitive. Both players had an amazing opening. That was a well-fought middle game that Black got the better of.